Hi. I'm going to finish this up now. Ooh. Look at all the art. Pretty sweet. Uh, now that I've done everything, there's one more called equals. I wonder what it's going to be. Hmm. Yeah. I don't know what's going to happen. Okay, everyone. We're going to be taking a break from the usual activities today. I was thinking since people are starting to talk about the festival, it's a good time for us to go over the general direction of the club and all that. I think it'll help us figure out what to do for the festival, you know? Oh, Sayori and I already came up with a good, really good plan. <laughs> really? For the festival? Still can't nail the voices. Really? For the festival? Wait, really? For the festival? Yeah, so this plan is this. Wait, so the plan is this, okay? <laughs> you and Yuri collect the information ahead of time on which clubs and classes are doing good things. Then we take a nap, map, and play the most efficient route so we can get to most of them before the lines get too long. Hey, that has nothing to do with the club. Well, you have to let me finish. Alright, fine, go ahead. Yeah, alright, fine, go ahead. Alright, so basically we get all the food we can. Come back here and we all eat together. That's all. Wow, I got tricked twice by the same joke. <laughs> got him. Boo, don't be a hater. It's not like you can come up with anything better. Look, even Gary was thinking about it. And I, I was. I would really prefer to do something literature related. We can eat together anytime. The festival is a unique opportunity. Festival. Besides, it's been quite a while since we've seen any new interest in the club. Yeah, I was thinking the same thing. We really got a, sh we really got a shot at showing people what the literature club is all about. I'll tell you what, we can do both, right? We'll make time for your food mission and still put together a public event. Oh my gosh, yes! I was just joking, but that's a really good idea! <laughs> well, I'm glad that's settled. I think the question is how to come up with an event that demonstrates everything you can get out of what you, you can get out of the literature book. Well, that's kind of tough, because everyone gets something different out of the club. Okay, how about this? Let's go around and have each of us talk about what we've gotten out of the club so far. That could really help us figure out what kind of reputation we want to build. Yeah! That's too embarrassing. Uh, but you'd have so much to talk about. That's Exactly why. And I'm sure Nasuki feels the same way. Well, maybe, but I didn't plan on arguing against it or anything. I mean, it's the literature club. We talk about this stuff together, right? And the only way to get more comfortable with it is to suck it up and do it. Oh, you're not wrong. I'm sorry for being resistant. It's not good to say suck it up because it sounds like their feelings won't matter. Great, my bad. It's just a habit I need to break. Well, anyway, who's gonna start? I'll start. I was the first to join, after all. Uh, wouldn't that be me? No, I wanna go first. Fine, fine. You can start. I don't mind. Yay! So, gosh, it feels like so long ago. I think I joined because I wanted to have fun sharing poems with people. It seemed like it would be a safe way to express myself. You know. Like if it's just a poem, then I can share it without feeling like I'm burdening everyone with my problems. And I thought it would be a really good way to get to know other people too. So yeah, I was really surprised when I walked in and it was just Monica. <laughs> and she was sleeping. <laughs> don't remind me of that. Wait, don't remind me of that. Oh gosh. Yeah, but it seemed like so much fun to help start a new club. Especially since writing helped me so much. I wanted to see it help other people too. But it ended up being me who was inspired. And I remember feeling like Monica was just so sweet and mature that I could trust her with anything. It made me feel a lot less alone, having someone who knew even the bad things about me. And at that point, I knew the literature club was going to be special for a lot of people. Yeah, I felt the same way. It really helped give the club a more cohesive vision. Yeah, and then Yuri joined, but she was so different from us, and that's a key too. I think for Yuri, it really helped for me to take the lead before she was able to open up a little. But Natsuki was kind of the opposite, 
where she wasn't ready to get really close to someone really quickly. I never really thought about that sort of thing. I really feel like I've gotten better at understanding people's different needs. And that makes me really happy, because my friends are just the most important thing to me. And whatever new members we get, I want to help them in those ways too. I don't know if I would have continued coming to the club if it weren't for you. Really? I know it wasn't too long ago, but it hurts to think about my behavior back then. I was really short-sighted. The only reason I came was to find others who were into fantasy. I suppose that was my idea of making friends with people. I remember feeling uncomfortable because you and I have such different energy. I had such a specific idea of the kind of person I could be friends with. So when Sayori tried so hard to get to know me, I feel like I was just wasting her time. I think I was naive to assume that similar interests were the key component of friendship. Sayori and I were able to be friends because she always thinks about the needs of other people. That's something I never knew how to do, or even thought to do. But I stayed in the club, thanks to that. And I started trying as hard as I could to understand people better. You really went above and beyond when it came to that. I was just super impressed. Well, I always hated that I didn't know how to behave like a person who is easily liked by others, like the two of you can. And because of that, I spent so much time thinking about my own behavior and all the wrong things I said. But the whole time, I should have been thinking about other people too. Not myself. Once I started doing that, I was able to make friends with everyone else. Oh, also, I discovered that sometimes I'm a better communicator when I take the time to write, rather than speak. It's so strange the way things turned out. It's so far different from anything I ever would have expected. But, I'm happy. I suppose we don't always know what we really need. Oh my gosh, you're so cute that I'm going to throw up! <laughs> That's nasty! <laughs> okay, please don't do that, Sailor. Besides, I'm not cute. Hey, isn't that my own? Oh, <laughs> well, for me, it's actually true, so what? <laughs> what are you saying? Nothing. I finished my part, so somebody else take their turn. My own! I have mine too! Sayori, take some deep- Wait, Sayori, take some deep breaths. Okay, fine, I'll go. Yuri, I can't believe you were complaining about doing this and still went before me. What a show. I was just- following up on Sayori. It was the easiest way to get it over with. Besides, you had not the most important thing that you got out of it. That you get out of this world. I did? Yeah! I read your supply of your favorite cupcakes! Oh yeah! Oh no! I forgot that too! I'm a traitor to the cupcake queen! Ah, it's not going to be! Yeah, I don't know if I want to go that. But neither of you are forgiven. Looks like only Monica will have her cupcakes next time. No! How can I ever make this up? <laughs> I can't eat that many cupcakes. Yeah, sure. Only you can. Hey. Hey. <laughs> uh, well, anyway, I'm just putting off topic. It's kind of hard to talk about this stuff. But I guess what it comes down to is that I'm in a much better place mentally than I was when I first joined. And that's because everyone helped me realize that I had some really toxic friendships going on outside the club. Uh, it was honestly a really painful thing to go through. Having to cut them out, it still hurts to think about. I'm sorry, Nancy. It's fine. I knew it was for the best, and it was right. I guess for me it's all about feelings. I was only ever ridiculed for having feelings, so I thought the right thing to do was just was to just ignore them. It took me a really long time to realize that it's not really how things are supposed to work. And I guess that's thanks to everyone who took the time to respect my feelings, even when I was being like the biggest jerk. I'm really sorry for being such a jerk to everyone. I was really the worst. Natsuki's voice chokes a little. We love you, Natsuki! I just hate that I was like that. Everyone did so much for me, and I could never do anything in return. That's not true. That's cute. You've done a lot more than you think. This club really wouldn't have been the same without you. I mean that. Who is this? 
remember how judgmental I was when you first showed up. It, it was like I couldn't accept anything other than my own idea of what a literature club was supposed to be. Apparently, that was more important to me than the opportunity to bring you some happiness. You really taught me that anything that makes someone happy is worthy of respect. You even inspired me to start playing piano. That's something that means a whole lot to me. So there's no need to put yourself down. Okay. As Q wipes her eyes. You helped me a lot too. It's so much fun to have you around. And you helped me become a better person. I'm holding your hand right now. Having a problem doesn't make me needy or inconvenient. It means that there's something that needs to be better for you. And you always deserve that. I agree. Seeing us have some of the same struggles made me a better person as well. I wouldn't want to change anything about our time here. I don't think any of us would. I'm sorry I got all dramatic. That's all I wanted to say. So Monica knew you were There's no need to apologize. It was something I wanted to talk about anyway, because it made a big difference for me. I was always such a strict perfectionist who never took enough time to believe in the best of other people. But everyone kept proving me wrong. I made the mistake multiple times thinking that my way was the best for everyone or thinking that I was needed to solve other people's problems. But I think being a leader means that you have to acknowledge that you're not perfect, and that the best thing you can do is to help guide people, rather than to do everything for them. We're all good people. We're all equals. I think that's the most important thing I've gotten out of the club, realizing what that really means. Sayori, what are you doing? I just thought that we should be writing some of these things down. Things about the club that are valuable to us. With a piece of chalk in her hand, Sayori writes the word trust on the chalkboard. And this is because you showed me that I can trust you with everything about me, not just my best friend. Suddenly, Yuri takes a piece of chalk as well. She writes understanding. I, I owe a lot of gratitude to everyone who took the time to understand me, even though it was so difficult for me to express myself. In that case, Monica takes a piece of chalk as well and writes the word respect. I always thought I was a respectful person. But it took the club for me to realize that there was more to it than I thought, and I'm a better person because of it. I have another one! Sayori writes, balance. Sometimes people want different things out of a friendship, where they need time before they're ready to become close. So it's important to keep things balanced between you and the other person. That reminds me. Yuri writes, reflection. I've always been a reflective person, but most of it has been nothing more than hating myself for all the things I thought I did wrong. Once I started reflecting on other people, and not just myself, a lot of things changed for me. So I think the mo that's sweet. so I think that's the most important one for me. That's great. We have a whole list of things now. Suddenly, everyone turns to look at Natsuki. Well, everyone took all the chalk. Don't look at me like that. Jeez. You could have just asked. Monica hands her piece of chalk to Natsuki. Then Natsuki sighs and writes self love. I don't know how far I've gotten. But it feels like things are at least on the right track. So there's my wait, so there, that's my contribution. Together, everyone stares at the words on the board. Wasn't this club supposed to be about literature? It is! We still do a lot of literature. Friendship and literature. Yeah, you were right. Friendship and literature. Natsuki and Yuri gently nod as well. Hey, let's all take a picture together. Ooh, we don't have one yet, right? Hey, you're right! Make sure you send it to me after! Wait, can I brush my hair first or something? Oh, you're fine. You already have the best hair out of all of this. Hmm? Everyone get together. I can't fit you all in. Okay. Okay, everyone ready? Eh, that was a little high for you. Okay, 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 everyone ready? And click! I'm really glad we talked about this stuff. It's easy to forget how far we've come, with only four members. Yeah! I have so many happy thoughts right now. I'm getting some really good inspiration for a poem. You know, I feel the same way. I kinda want to get some writing done. Me too. I think I would like that as well. Everyone's looking at me again. I'll do it too. Wait, I'll do it too. Everyone's looking at me again. I'll do it too. But I might not feel like sharing. That's okay. 
the four members of the literature club disperse and return to their desks, each equipping themselves with a pen. Natsuki and Yuri give each other a quick glance, then start writing immediately. Siori stretches, then does the same. But Monica is left tapping her pen against the paper, unsure of where to start. Ellipsis. Just move your hand. Monica mouths to herself. Mouse. Mouse. Right the way to your heart. Her mind full of thoughts, memories, and inspiration, Monica navigates past her mental barriers and begins to write. It doesn't matter what, just that it's something new. Whoa! Sweet! Sequence. Ooh. Mm. It just makes me feel all warm and fuzzy inside. <laughs> that was fun. They did a good job on it too. So many more people are working on this. When they partnered with Serenity Forge. Whoa. What a big team. Look at what they've grown into ever since it came out back in 2017. There were like 10 people that made it. And now they have like all these <laughs> other ones. Uh, so many names! <laughs> Everyone from 2017 be like, I erased this! You do that like a uh, Kaguya Sama Chika meme. I raised that boy. <laughs> Ooh, thank you, dear player, for enjoying our story of friendship and literature. Yeah! Thank you for making it. Ooh. Um, I'm proud of Dan Salvato. He's come so far. Sweet picture. I like it. Yay! All done. That was a nice little ending there. Um, I have a lot of things so far. Still have a little bit to get through, but here's the picture. <laughs> what? <laughs> uh, I didn't see that. Whoa! Oh, and then I have all of this too. Dude. Uh, that was so sweet. Just touching. I think they did a good job on it. Yay. Okay, goodbye.